before getting into recruitment, let's stick with the season. When you look at what took place last year, how exciting, fun was that ride to and to hang that banner in your gym? It was it was unbelievable. I mean, we if we would have had everybody healthy, that would have been one of the best teams OKO's ever had with Harry Giles and Joe Hampton, and then with me, Lindell, Braxton Key, Mario Kegler. Like we were stacked. Like we had the platoon system if we, if we needed to. But that that joy of us, you know, just getting to making it all the way to. New York playing in the Madison Square Garden in front of so many people playing on ESPN, which is unbelievable. And then the fact that we won it just made it even, it was surreal. The, the feeling was, was surreal. You, even in the fashion that you won it. Oh, yeah, like on a, a buzzer beater. Although we were up 18 in the third quarter, we should have closed the door right there. But, you know, you had to make it good for TV, get the ratings up. <laughs> you pulled up for three in the closing seconds. Did you want that bad? Mama mentality, baby. I was going through my head. See, it was like it was like seven seconds left. So I was like, if I shoot it, if I miss, I'm not going to miss it bad. It was going to play with the rim. Or it was supposed to go in and play with the rim. But I knew it was going to have time to get it back. I had Braxton running to the left and Kadeem running to the right. So, you know. Everything works out perfectly. <laughs> how, how has your game changed uh, between the time that you started this high school journey to, to now? I think one is I'm being more vocal. You know, I'm, I think I used to be like too nice, you know, let friendships get involved with stuff. But you just got to leave that alone. And on the court, you're trying to win. We all trying to be successful. So you got to be more vocal. You got to get in people. And then another thing is being aggressive. Like being aggressive just helps my game easier and make the others around me game easier. So. What's been the best part of your game that you've seen mature over time? I think just being able to just run the show and just lead. You know, I think that's what sets me apart from most people. Like I'm able to, I can lead, I can pass, and then when I need to, I can score the ball, and then that just separates me from others. Playing on, on a team with a lot of guards and a lot of experienced and, and good guards that are going to high major schools is the competition just crazy. It's competitive, sometimes. like practice. Like we go at it every time. It's gonna be somebody's day. It's gonna be. It's not gonna be somebody's day. But at the end of the day, you're gonna get better because you're competing. You know, with Lindell, Devonte, Tyshawn, we competing every day, and we all trying to play. We all trying to. At the end of the day, we all want to be on the floor. So. When it is your day, what's good about Matt Coleman? When it's my day, uh, he's winning. He's got a smile on his face. Uh, others around him are happy to play with him because he's making things easy for them. And you know everything is just falling in place, falling in suit, and then coach is happy. <laughs> Looking at your recruitment, taking some visits, uh, already have done some visits yeah. in the past. Where does it sit right now for you? Uh, right now, I'm I'm completely open with between Stanford, Texas, and Duke. Uh, I visit Texas this weekend, matter of fact, uh, October 28th. So I just want to see what they have to offer. I know Shaka, been knowing Shaka for a, a while now. He's coached me this past summer, and then with Duke, you got. D Coach K, you know, and the historical, you know, part that goes into that and what he has done there. And then with Stanford, it's just, it's unique. Stanford is unique. And then what they have to offer beyond basketball is something that you got to keep an eye on. Any favorites at this point? Other than in those top three, is mm -hmm. there one maybe in the back of your mind that says, yeah, I kind of want to go there? Um, I, I would say that, but I wouldn't because they, all, they all have something different to offer. So it's a piece of me that wants to go. To, to each place, but right now, I really can't tell you where. What are you looking for? What I'm looking for, I'm looking for having that relationship with the coach, you know, that he trusts me and I trust him, you know, that he's going to help better me to get where I'm going to go and he can trust that, you know, if things are not going right, that I'm going to be able to still get the job done for him. And do you have a timetable for your decision? Some days I want to sign early, some days I want to sign late. So, but right now, after I take this Texas visit, I should have an idea of where I, where I really want to go.